Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome to 196 of Sogalog. I am uh, uh, super, super sketched and scared and nervous and uh, all the above. Because we have a, uh, another, not as stressful episode as last episode. Because if you guys didn't see last episode, oh my gosh, you better check it out. Because that was probably one of the more stressful episodes of Sogalog. It's not the most stressful, but it was one of the more stressful. So, yeah, last episode, we... Things happened. Not anything bad, as you can see, because our team's still the exact same. So that's nice, at least. Just at least not that part, nothing bad there happened. Because it could have been so much worse than it was. So I'm not, I'm not mad. It could, like I said, it could have been so, so much worse. But we are in the very very at we're at the very we're at the tail end of the game we are at story dump and exposition alley um but 55 times 1.15 1. i don't think i did that right hold on i figure while we do this we can kind of talk about oh i made my predictions really i should probably wait before i send it to enjoy though because Things should happen real quickly in the world of football. Um, I've looked this up like 800 times. I'm sure like Megu was like, why? Stop looking this up. It's literally the same thing. The world of ice. Oh, I said 55 because of that. Okay. 51 times 1.15. That might be better. What? No, 51 times 1.15. 58.6. Okay. So, yeah, our level cap is really high. The world of ice. Haxorus, use Dragon Tail. It did nothing. Haxorus, get back here. Not only did the ice stay unbroken, there's not even a scratch. What's going on? I don't think this is going to work, you silly scoundrel. I remember you from Ed's castle. Yeah, you better. It's a bitter cold. I'm shivering. I'm suffering, but I'm alive. Why would you even do that to yourself? Like, you literally are like, I'm suffering because of my stupidity of making the world ice. Hashtag global cooling. I don't know. That's, that's that's their entire plan, and it's super weird. I don't get it. But <laughs> this is literally what blocks you off from getting to Route Nine, which is funny because of like this is the weirdest way to block the player. Because this area was blocked, I believe, beforehand. Anyways, wait, is it not? Wait a minute. Is it actually not? Was it actually not blocked and I was dumb and didn't get my encounter and now I'm locked off? I th I think that's what just happened. Hip -out on. Um, level 49. Hip -out on. That's not fun, but we'll live with it. We'll get out here. I, I think I messed up hardcore. But... We, we, we live with our mistakes now, don't we? Um, because, yeah, I literally have no access to this area. Oh, shoot. I need to stop running into this back because I'm literally fighting things that, like, are, that are completely unnecessary that I don't need to fight right now. And that's not going to be helpful for the long run. Also, that's an ouchy kind of play for me to fight. Magma Storm, that shouldn't do that much. It's, yeah. Okay, I know I should not be speeding up right now. I, I really know that, but, like, it's fine. We're, we'll live. Okay, Jonas, level up. Cool, 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 cool. I'm kind of upset that I did that. Ooh, that is a cheeky way to block that off. I'm not falling for that. But, yeah, so that's blocked off. We can't go in there and over there anymore. And we, I don't, I swear, there's, I, I missed that encounter. So that's a that's definitely a good job me moment because I my I did not put that together that I was gonna have to take care of that so or that I could go get that so I lost out on an encounter that's a 
kind of a big loss because I don't think that ice melts until post game. Which, again, kind of a big oof, but stuff happens. It's, it is what it is, but Jonas is going to lead off. Oh my gosh, that's a Haxorus. That's all 51. Ha. Huh. That is not what I expected to be fighting pretty much instantly, especially with Dragon Claw. That's a tough move. It's okay. We live with it. It's livable. We're going to be okay. Oh, that's not as livable, though. Didn't do that much. Why was that, like, that other Pokemon that we fought so terrifying then? Star Raptor. Oop, that's a, that's a yeet. That's a yeet moment right then and there. <laughs> no name, get out here, please. Um, now normally, Star Raptor has close combat. Thank goodness it's not a normal playthrough, because, like, it better not have a fighting move. I say that and I'm like, it could still have a fighting move and it could still be a problem in the exact way that I'm saying it's about to be a problem. And plus, it is not going to be a problem in that way though because it's going to go bye bye Honestly, I should probably move the Lucky Egg though because No Name is getting so much experience just seemingly because of that. Lucky Egg, it replaced with the Scope Lens. Honestly, that's a fine trade for now. Jonas is being the one that's being utilized right now. If anybody can have that Lucky Egg, it can be him. Honestly, Siren's not being used. And to be honest, I don't mind that because we're getting, we're letting, we're throwing opportunity for other Pokemon to shine. And I do like that because, I don't know, I'm somebody who likes having all of my Pokemon shine or have all my Pokemon be a part and so when it's only like Siren or Oogle Blip taking all of literally everything it makes it difficult for me Ooh, well Siren's coming out <laughs> uh snow warning that's actually kind of funny I feel like that should actually just generally be there so funny enough but it's not so it's it is just non-existent there, literally, but mud shot does nothing, but our accuracy, our speed falls, our speed falls, not our accuracy. But speed falling did not matter, that Marowak is bopped, because Marowak was not surviving a surf there. No way, and heckled. Hmm. I'm staying in. I think that's the play. Well, Lewis, that's fine, actually. I don't think this is going to kill. I'm going to see what this damage range is. Okay, Siren, you have gotten really good recently. What in the world are you getting into? Because you're definitely into something right now that's, like, making you really good. And I do not know how to feel about that. But luckily, we can just go to straight to the Pokemon Center. Because I saw the third dude. I think there were only three dudes. There might be a fourth dude. And if there is, I still feel like... Oh, wait. Do I have... I do have to come out of it at this angle. Okay. That's kind of ridiculous. But I guess... We do what the game tells us we have to do. And we just do it. <laughs> do it willingly. Um, Delibird. Oh, it's a shady penguin. Um, I feel like I've talked about it on this series, but if I haven't, um, Shady's doing a new series with the core, like, not the core four, but with, like, Luke, Vinny, Dylan, and I'm excited to see and watch how that unfolds and kind of works out because I feel like it's an absolute crazy situation because I would not have I'm so happy to see that Shady's back into that kind of stuff like into the multi people projects 
because it like it gives me like newfound hope in a way not in like a weird way but in a more like a that's awesome like people are people are gonna come back because shady was so monumental to pokemon in general so the fact that we're seeing him come back to his roots and come back to the pokemon itself is gonna be like i think just big for pokemon in general so i'm very happy to see that uh, but I'm also, like, excited because then it's like, oh, you're, like, your literal, like, creator that you paid attention to, watch, cared about, like, to an insane degree is back. So it's like, if you're getting anybody back, you might as well get the one that you, like, care insanely about. It's a big uplift, right? Because, like, it would, I, I guess, it it's kind of on the same level as if let's say you like have a friend right and that friend it's a weird relationship but that friend wait what oh it's telling you where to fight now uh, but where that friend was like in a different like world like they were like in a different country for years but you couldn't communicate with them <laughs> for them to come back um, and that's a really neat and cool experience. Oh my god. For crying out loud, I cannot freaking, uh, freaking stay put today. Um, my body's not put together. Yikes, 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 yikes. That is, again, not a Pokemon I do don't want to be fighting. Yuxi literally bodies me. Except for Curious. Is this going to be Curious's episode to shine? That's possible. Because this is the second straight time I had to pull Curious out of the hat. And it's only Calm Minding, which means it might only be able to Calm Mind on um, Curious. Which again, I have no qualms about that whatsoever. Yeah, it can literally, it could literally only use curious. Freaking yes, curious. Keep it going. Keep this trend going, curious. Two thousand experience. That's not bad. Jonas level fifty six, and we have a mighty Yana. Hmm. I mean, I have Jonas now. I have a fighting type that can just drill into the mighty Yana, make it pretend it's not even there. I might as well use it. Might as well use it for its intended purpose. It... Pop. Again, it's one of those Pokemon I'm very curious to see what happens when I bring it in. Also, the level cap is 58. And we are approaching that cap fast. But he, I'm another curious thing. Interesting. Okay. But yeah, being the fact that we're approaching that level cap fast, I got to avoid trainers. I, I have to. It's like it's a must. Um, which is gonna be weird, but that level cap is just gonna be instantaneous. It feels like. Um, but then after that, our caps are really high. So. Because we're, ba we're essentially, this is the game where it's weird because there's no actual mid-level person. So it's really going to be a difference between the Elite Four and the gym, or the, the Elite Four's like, like right next to the Elite Four's ace is where we'll be training to, which is going to be nice, but... I believe that he just healed my Pokemon. Oh, Shadow Triad. No, 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 no. Oh. <clears throat> I believe... Yeah, look at me go. I remember things that I probably feel like I... I don't feel like I remember this, but... Apparently I do. I remember enough of it. <sighs> this is another curious thing. Oh boy. Wait, it's ghost and poison. It's not a curious thing, actually. 
This is a no-name thing. Let's rephrase. No name takes care of this. Not curious. No. Shadow Claw. That's gonna do like nothing. That does nothing. Yeah. We Shadow Ball this thing to death. That's what we do. Because that's super effective. It probably doesn't kill, but it does enough damage to actually be sur sufficeable. Ooh. Suffice to say. I'm gonna bullet punch. I act yeah, I'm gonna bullet punch. I know that's probably gonna kill. But it's fine. I'd rather lose all my PP on Bullet Punch out of any move that I've got in my arsenal. Star Raptor. We stay in because of Star Raptor. We learned that we flash cannon this thing and bop it to oblivion. Entrainment. Ooh. Solid rock. Interesting. That is a very key information to note. Venomoth. Is going to be taken out with a... Lopany with clickbait. Clickbait's taking this thing out. It is a Venomoth, so we should be able to strength it twice and be okay. Oh, uh, maybe not actually, because uh Oh my gosh, that actually the dry skin actually came in clutch. Because now we kill. Wow! More random ways we've been beating Pokemon. 19,000 Jesus Louise. Extra receivers ringing. Bozzy, a strange ship is flying towards Opelousa City, right? I saw it, too. You're in route, Sharon. That's Team Plasma's ship, isn't it? Yes, no doubt about it. Anyways, I'll be arriving there in just a moment. Okay, I'll leave things to you. Bozzy, if you run into any trouble, call me. Gonzo, I can't. Ugh. If there were only two of me, then I could protect the town and chase them, too. Oh, hi, Sharon. I didn't think you were going to be here that fast. Bozzy, Drayden, glad to see you safe and well. Hey, Sharon, you have certainly grown. I hear that you filled in for Lenora as becoming the gym leader of Asperia City. Thanks. We should catch up. Save the catching up for later. I have a good idea of where King Plasma is hiding. The place with the lowest temperature in the Nova region right now is the area close to Humalau City. Drayden, please protect Apple's City. Gonzo and I will find Team Plasma. Very well. I'll do my part and thanks. The chase I'll leave to you. But don't do anything reckless. Bozzy, I could use your help if you're willing. You are a skilled trainer and could go toe to toe with Team Plasma. That's my definition of useful. Drayden, we're off. Can I just go to Undella Town now? Because this blocks me off, right? Yeah, it does. It forces me to fly. Cool. Good, 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 good. I, I'm getting my bearings. I got my bearings straight. I feel like, actually. Can't I? Can't I take the shortcut way? This is dumb of me to think about because I don't think I can. I think it's under construction right now. But I'm going to try it. I don't see why not. Got it. From there, go through the marine tube. I was not freaking wrong. What? This is actually the intended way? Do I just not go the intended way the entire time? Why am I not shocked by that? Why am I not shocked? Also, we need a thumbnail. We need a freaking thumbnail. Can I, like... I feel like that we found a thumbnail on that. We had to have. I did not expect it to be that quick. I didn't know you could do that. Like, okay. So, um, with that being said, does that mean what I think it does for our situation? Does that mean I just get encounters the rest of this episode? Because to me, that's what that means. That this is encounter time now. Ooh, I don't want to fight you. Don't make me fight trainers, please. Or at least don't make me fight enough trainers to be worrisome. I mean, what level are they going to be, like, realistically? 52s? Okay, they're in the 50s. We're okay. Siren, I feel like I can trust you here. You should fly. I could have. I could. I could. I could. I could. I was right. 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 Cool. 
I'm sorry. Siren, you're being trustworthy today. Brick Break. Oh, that's a good move. I am getting rid of Tackle for Brick Break. Because Brick Break is 75. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. <sighs> Bye, Tackle. We got a reliable fighting tackle. Raichu, that is a automatic swap -a doodle into Oogle Blip. I laugh. Oogle Blip has actually been utilized so much recently. It just doesn't feel right to use Oogle Blip the amount that we have been. But, you know. You know, the only one that knows is knows, so. Magnarize, we're fine, we're chill. That's dead right you there. Okay. I don't want to fight trainers. There's an encounter. Which I believe this is going to count as Himalau City. Unfortunately. But we'll find out. I hope it doesn't. Oh. Why are you causing issues? You should not be causing issues. You are a C dot. You are a C dot. You should not be causing issues. Thank you for the critical capture on random Pokemon that we don't need critical captures on, but okay. I mean, I knew Boggy. Boggy is your name. I don't know why Boggy is your name. Boggy's your name. Today, you have been named Boggy. I don't even know. Oh, Bob. No. I want Bog. Boggy. Oh my god. For a second. No, 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 no. Stop. No, no, no. Run away. Okay. This is fine. This is fine. This is okay. Oh. There's a doctor trainer. We can skip the doctor trainer. Because... <clears throat> Seaside Cave. Cool. This is another encounter. We're good. We're getting here. In any way that we can. And our Seaside Cave encounter. Who are we using to catch Pokemon? It's it's Lopany. Lopany's just been our Pokemon to catch Pokemon. So the fact that we didn't actually have it out, we are lucky we ran into a Dot. We are very lucky that that was what we ran into. Marill. Not a fan. I, I am not a fan. I am so much not a fan. I'm actually going to run from it. I'm actually legitimately going to run from it. I just don't like... Marill's not my cup of tea. I'm sorry. But it's the truth. At least I'll be honest. It's not my cup of tea. And I don't really like it. So... It's the first encounter we're actually legitimately running from. But we do need to catch... Or get some Pokeballs. Get some stuff. We got a few encounters to get, actually. So, we might as well get them now. And, uh, well, let's double check what it says for, uh, where we caught this Pokemon. Does it say Humilocity? City? Route 21. So, it is not Humilocity, City, which means that we can get an encounter in Humilocity. City. But, let's sell some items first. Oh my gosh, I got 200,000. Never mind. We still can't even buy full restores. Oh my gosh. Wow, okay. I was not expecting that. But yeah, let's get a Human Life City encounter. Because this is Human Life. Does it change? Oh. After you beat, get the badge, we'll look for Team Plasma. Wait, what? Oh, cool. So, he basically just told me that Team Plasma is not a problem right now. Don't deal, don't worry about Team Plasma. And that we'll deal with it later. Like, get your encounter first. Which, I will not say no. Oh my, we have backup for Jonas. We have backup. He's back. The one, the only, Daddy of the Machamp. Freaking yeah. <laughs> Y'all know what was just about to be said in my head. Like, what was the, what the words that just hit my head at that very moment. But we caught him. Yes. Uh, 
I'm freaking, I am bold lettering this, okay? I'm sorry to Joy, but this is with the exclamation points too. We're doing it. We're being that, we are being that way today. I feel like that's what we're doing. Uh, that is a trainer that I don't feel like fighting right now. I skipped that trainer. But yeah, we got some encounters to do. Okay, the Route 22 encounter is a Lickitung. I am not opposed to that. I'll, I'll strength it, see if it lives one, which it does. I was like, it should. Special defense rose, that's fine. Cool, that was an easy catch. And I know what I'm naming this, because it's my friend's favorite Pokemon. So, now that I get to name it, I can name it Patrick, because it's my friend's favorite Pokemon. Okay, final encounter and final thing that we get to do in today's episode is double-check this. And it could be good, it could be bad. Giant Chasm... What do you got? Amanda Buzz, huh? Why are you level 47? Um, I'm gonna glare you first because you're level 47 and you can throw out some random BS at me. But you are a defensive monster and I don't mind having a defensive monster on the team. That was another easy capture. I'm naming you. I'm naming you Sally. Sally. Also, this entire naming theme is supposed to be Muppet Muppets, and I just completely disregarded that fact. Oh my. Oh my. That's bad. Do I do it to save freaking... Ugh, do I do it to save Lopity's life? Do I do it to save Lopity's life? How much do I love clickbait? Oh... I feel like the answer to that question is already known. The fact this thing has shadow tag. I'm actually upset that I have to do this, but I'm doing it. I'm using my master ball to get out of the situation. I'm naming it no because it's not a part of the team, and I'm gonna go release it for you guys. Oh, that's rough. It's rough, yes, but I hope that my team takes it as a gesture of, oh, he really trusts us and believes that we can do it. Because I just lost out on some massive stuff because of that. But I, like, that was trying, my, my hope was to get the Terrakion, but it's not there yet. I don't get the item that was attached to it. It had Struggle Bug, Metal Sound, Bug Bite, Psy Wave. It actually didn't have a good moveset at all. We could have... <laughs> it wasn't worth the risk. 
it, it really wasn't worth the risk to me. I like clickbait a lot. Clickbait's been a fun mon for me. Um, I don't think there's any mon on my team I was willing to risk um, to deal with the shadow tag mon. I think I made the right decision, even though it sucks in the moment. I think that preservation-wise, that makes the most sense. That make that I think I made a great call, but you guys can let me know what you guys think in the comment section below this video. I I feel like it was a good call, but you guys can think otherwise. But yeah, we'll guys see you in the next episode. Um, well, we get to get trained up to level 58, which is actually, or 57, which is not that far off from where we're at, actually. I thought that was going to be a lot further of a level gap, but it's not. So we'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.